hi my beautiful gemini welcome to my channel goddess of light 11 11 if you are new to my channel welcome if you are returning subscribers welcome back this reading is for my lovely gemini sun moon rise and venus and jupiter thank you god thank you universe universal energies ancestors spirit guy archangels ascended masters please give my lovely gemini a clear precise honest message for the highest good all right gemini if you are new to my channel don't forget to hit the like the subscribe button the notification bell below if you're returning subscribers welcome back i do appreciate each and every one of you that are supporting my channel i'm grateful and thankful i'm sending lots of love no beginning and prosperity your way energies are fluid this reading may or may not resonate with you if it's not resonate check out your other birth chart placement for more clarity take what resonates and leave the rest all right gemini let's see what the universe has for you and your love life oh by the way guys so this is eclipse season and also uh retrograde so be mindful you know um about people coming told you guys x returning all the x is coming out of the woodwork some of you might be getting um uh, you know communication from people um also apologies but you know you have to wait after you know michael retrograde to see if these people are genuine or not so be mindful out of x is coming out of the woodwork there's a lot of and especially it's in taurus you know and taurus is you know um, mercury and retrograde and taurus could be things could be a little bit slower than normal so if people come and told you guys you, their behaviors they're slow they're taking their time and stuff let them do their things see to see if it's thick if it's thick after Marco retrograde so we have not for you so you know um we've been having a very consistent you know energy for you guys my lovely gemini so the energy been very consistent when it's come to you so hold on yeah, the energy have been very very consistent for you so we have not for you some of you might be dealing with your soulmate with your twin flames and yeah we are we having a lot of soulmate a lot of twin flame coming to the surface at this time because a lot of people heal from the past a lot of people heal from their lesson a lot of people is leaving the comic behind to come forwards here so again be mindful still look at who is who um is this person is genuine is this person is coming for a good reason and also for the new and stuff you guys might also having your new person come in as you know a soulmate or a twin flame you need to pay attention whether it's a karmic or a real person because there's a lot of lesson that still need to be learned here especially in 2022 because we we still are in you know in uh a new year of the soulmate or a new year of the ball game no moon you know i said no moon so something about the no moon here that happens for you guys that might be not for you so all right so i'm using you know multiple oracles here because of this energy here so we have seven dpd so something could be repeating for you guys you know that's what i'm getting it's like you guys could be find yourself be very lucky floating on the air but i felt like you guys need to come down this earth and try to work things in and so you can start moving forwards so yes look at that which word are you going to take there's the light right there's some light here that that's open for you guys to move away from any things that's not serving your highest good but you guys going to be you guys might be in a crossword at this time with this um energy here this is almost like the two of ones we have number 13 that turn on 204 but if you guys need to um move forwards moving on the word is clear for you there's the lie at the end of the tunnel for you guys but you guys are going to have to make a decision to end things you guys might actually really really like someone 
I'm going to be honest with you guys. We have number five here, change transformation. And we have the why. It look like you guys really, really like someone. You guys hoping for this relationship to work. But it's it's like this is you guys might have to learn some type of lesson from this person. Or they have to learn some type of lesson uh, from you. But whichever way this goes and stuff like that, I feel like this ending is inevitable because it's been coming for you and your reading over and over it's like how someone met you that was like oh my god gemini is and i is destined to be together or you guys felt like you guys are destined together but there's some type of lesson here so you guys are going to have to figure this on your own and go to the distance here go to the distance because this is not a personal reading you guys this is something you guys are going to have to uh, like go um figure this on your own but spirit say you guys are almost at the finish line you are going to win you are going to be okay all you have to do is just to make that decision here to move forward and you guys i feel the energy so yes we are in mercury retrogrades i might be talking longer than i need to and i'm trying to cut it back and you guys um i just want to make sure that you guys understand the message if it's not resonate with you that's because it's not for you they don't mean that to post any negative comments or anything like that it's just meant it's not for you and things might come out the wrong way it might not come out you know proper way you know miscommunication misunderstanding all that will going to happen so you guys just have to take it day by day i want to feel the, the way again someone in here want to feel the same way they feel when they first met you okay this is the energy they say here someone want to feel that energy again you came closer than anyone yes and we have i wish i could take back my words so there could be some negative words stay you know stated here and you guys might be dealing with someone that is younger than you someone that is very um they don't know how to talk to people it's time for me to heal now yes this is you know what i'm getting this is for both of you and it's time for me to heal so there's definitely someone could be immature they could be younger than you the words might not coming out right when they are talking talking but i feel like you know um this will give you a way to move forward gemini so hopefully you guys could take this energy and just take it and find your way back to yourself see what it say here um requited love lets your friends help you i can't make this up i kind of feel like you guys are in a relationship that's not supposed to be it's a lesson pay attention to the red flags unrequited love they say i'm cautioning you so you guys are in a relationship that's not supposed to last it's supposed to be teaching you guys a lesson whether you learn that lesson or not see release your ex mm. a lot right let's see who you are dealing with the energy of this person gemini is dealing with spirit please I haven't have any cards flew out until now give me one more card please for this person energy gemini is dealing with oh my goodness if you guys don't know i felt like now you know we have knight of wands in the reverse you guys dealing with some someone that is strictly a player very fickle very player like page of wands in the reverse this person might actually cheating on you and not knowing this is the energy there's no need to go among someone in his stick secretly if they are not if they are not doing anything which is i doubt it this person is playing they feel like they are a player like you know what i'm saying this is what i'm getting here knight of wands in the reverse the moon and we have two of wands in the reverse someone in here is strictly playing you know they this someone in here could be playing with your emotion they're very fickle very player like player from from the human layer but whomever they are stuff like that you don't need that you deserve a lot more than that gemini you don't you don't need that
they are not you know <laughs> let me tell you the funny part is we have two nine we have nine of cups we have nine of wands we have the death card let me tell you i want to telling you someone tell try to tell themselves that oh i changed but what i'm getting here with the you see how that nine of wands looking at the nine of cups is just someone in here very determined this person is a snake when I looking at the when I looking at the death card here, I never point out to the snake because I never felt like you know. But when I felt I found I felt that this person is a snake. They love entertaining other people. The nine of cups here. They this person love getting uh, entertaining other people. They like getting attention from other people, and they are not intend to change anytime soon. Nine of ones here. This person is very determined to have their wish fulfilled their wish not this is what they want you to know their wish they say they change but i don't feel it someone in here say i want change i want transformation but this person is a snake mm. yeah i'm telling you like i've been saying to you guys over and over it's here this person love other people they love getting attention they have attention you guys might be dealing with a leo aries uh, sagittarius because we have this person is the straight player this is a snake you guys doesn't need to deal with this person uh. Someone in here, um, I feel nauseated. Just this, what I saw in this reading here. Look at the moon, nine of wands in a reverse, two of wands in a reverse, king of wands, uh uh, straight player. Very fickle. They don't, it seems like this person has no regards for, you know, other human beings and stuff. Is my way or no way at all? That's what I'm getting here. Palace of Cups. This is someone that, you know, this person caring. They, they, you know, it's like someone say, well, I care about you. Doesn't that supposed to be enough? If I, this is the energy that I'm getting. Like, if I care for you, that's supposed to be enough. You shouldn't be asking for more. Let me enjoy myself. Let me entertain in my other parties and stuff like that does it matter and stuff there's too many snake in here snake over here snake over here this person is a snake a, a cool person a snake there's a, there is going to be an ending between you and this person i'm sorry to say that to you i talk about that already you know if someone ended a relationship doing the Mercury retrograde, it's good for you, okay? It is good for you, especially if someone in here is not treating you with utmost respect. I feel like you guys deserve the respect. I feel like you guys need someone that's going to treat you with utmost respect, that's going to treat you like a king, that's going to treat you like a queen, you know, a goddess, someone in here that's, you know, um, treat you like everyone deserves to be treated that's what i'm getting here not like a not like a third option not like you know a piece of you know property passing you around and things like that for when or when they felt like to you know when they felt like to deal with they deal with i don't want i don't condemn that energy at all they are going to come and apologize to you and we have two of we have six of cups here we have the world someone in here going to apologize to you especially you guys what you might not know someone in here might be dealing with someone from their past they already have a cycle close with they might be trying to reopen the cycle here with someone from their past but they are going to try to apologize their intention is they are going to apologize to you here mm. wow You guys need to find your stability. This person might be stable. They might be grounded. You know, I mean, I'm not saying, 
not grounded but they might be very stable they it look like someone here they have their own stability eight of wands their actions towards you is eight of wands um five of cups and four of wands so there's going to be some type of no communication between you and this person they might stop talking to you they might you know um but they're going to be feeling some type of regret or remorse which is that you know who cares let them do them and stuff you know i know you guys might love this person you cares about this person but yes they do cares about you but i'm, I'm not feeling i'm not feeling the respect here the respect you guys deserve the high priestess is at the bottom maybe you guys need to talk to this high priestess it look like you know there's some type of secret here there's the high priestess no you guys need to find healing and let this person you know let them fly let this bird fly because this is not this is not the right person for you again let's clarify the death card spirit please Mm -hmm. look at this look at this mm. five of cups four of pentacles and we also have five of cups five of pentacles four of pentacles yeah let them be feeling left out in the cold because this person have is they have no problem this is what they're going to this is what they plan to do they have no problem doing it so why should you sit in there and try to enabling this person to to making you feel like you are broken i feel like if you guys decided to stay with this snake to let to deal with this snake you're going to be feeling so broken because you can see this person is going to hold back from you they are going to leave you out in the cold and then after that they're going to play the victim so which means you know what kind of person this person like i've been talking in your reading about this you guys might be dealing with the covet narcissist this person is a snake you don't need to be dealing with them let's clarify the king of wands spirit please clarify the king of wands for me King of Wands, it was Leo Sagittarius. It looks like this person is talking to someone from their past. They have in conversation from their past. They are making an offer to someone from their past. This is point blank uh, period. They are might be seeing a counselor with someone they from their past. They are working together with someone here. They are going to make an offer to it is someone from their past. Whomever this king of wands here, for those of you that are dealing with the Aries Leo Sagittarius, this king of wands here is trying to make an offer to someone to a soulmate from their past, someone that they consider a soulmate. I told you guys already why I told you this person is talking to someone from their past. It's here again. Can't make this up. I don't think like you guys can have anything clearer than this. Thank you spirit for the wisdom and confirmation here. I don't think this could be any clearer than your guys needed to. Clarify the moon please. The temperance flow out and the reverse. Yeah, you're dealing with someone who's those um this I'm getting a mean, you know, like when the temperance is in a reverse, it's a good, angelic, someone that is caring, someone that is loving and stuff. Ace of Pentacles here, the moon, someone in here might be hiding, you know, money, someone in here could be getting there's someone in here that is secretly getting some type of offer here and that's why the reason that they are moving see page of wands you guys are not going to know this about this person because they might be getting some type of offer here page of one page of ones here ace of ones they are getting some type of information but they keep it a secret because i'm hearing someone say it's none of your business so whomever this is you guys are dealing with this person is fake is here you don't need to deal you don't need that you don't need that yeah you can see like look at this this is like probably the most ugliest arranging card you can ever seen so i'm going to explain myself be patient 19 minutes we're good so 
let me tell you, player, 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 player. Because Nine of Cups is not always wish fulfillment. Sometimes the Nine of Cups and stuff like that is someone that like dealing with a lot of people. Some is depending on what card is following to see Nine of Wands in the reverse and the um you know seven of cups my two worst cards in the deck here so yeah this person is a snake you guys don't need that you guys deserve better better you guys deserve someone who's going to treat you well going to respect you but i feel like a cycle is coming to an end you know you guys should let it in but that's just up to you i cannot telling you who you need to be with who you want to be with you know that's just up to you let's clarify the wall here please Queen of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Like I said, someone in here is trying to make a decision. They might be juggling you. And an earth sign, someone that someone that felt like is stable, that is grounded. You know, they could be want to be with this earth sign because of stability, financial stability here. They could be someone they are hardworking by. And they decided someone decided okay so it could be uh, someone that is even at a distance from them but it seemed like you know they are hardworking by this person and they are trying to figure things out and stuff like that uh, whether they should be with this person one way or the other so what are they regretting for okay, five, five. we have the five of cups here twice oh Mm, 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 mm. this you know what gemini the good thing is you are going to be a miss opportunity for them eight of cups look at this mess eight of cups seven of cups seven of cups here again seven of cups five of wands you are going to be a miss opportunity for this person they could be play victim all they want that's what i'm getting here you know there could be a lot of arguing you know you don't need to be in a relationship all you guys do is fight all you guys do someone in here going to feeling stuck with you know with the eight of cups here they going they feel like they cannot move away from this someone in here might have a really ugly addiction like they have a personality you know disorder here like they want they need to have a lot of people boost up their ego they need to have a lot of people pump them up and stuff they need to have a wall of cheerleader around them that's what i'm getting here three of cups and i feel like you know Someone in here going to friends on you, yeah, and they're going to hold back. That's what they're going to do. Let's see what Gemini should do when it's come to this person. What Gemini should do. See what they say here? Where's your vibration? The reason they say you need to raise your vibration because it look like someone in here is getting you guys and your low, you know, getting you and your lowest vibration because they are in a low vibration. So what you should do is raise your vibration so you can use the discernment so you know this person is not good for you. So you have the strength and courage to leave them behind, to leave that snake behind. Bye, Gemini. I love you guys. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share the video. Bye.